Hello, my name is Kyle Koberlein. I'm a sales professional at Bluegrass International Trucks, Buses, RVs, and Ideal Lease. Today, I'm standing in front of a 2021 International CV 515. The CV was a product that was derived from a partnership between International and General Motors. On the front of this International CV, we've got a contoured black bumper, chrome grille, and a bug screen, which is good for protecting the radiator from rock chips and debris. Over the years, International has done a great job of allowing easy access under the hood. And on the International CV as well, there's a hood latch. So if the wind was to gust, it won't close. You have to actually release the hood latch on the hood. I'm here at the front driver's side corner of the International CV. Uh, this vehicle does actually come with a remote key fob, which is real handy for your drivers or yourself. Uh, you got a continental tire on a polished aluminum wheel. These wheels do have a 50 degree wheel cut. That's gonna be a lot better than any of your pickup style vehicles for maneuverability in a productive day. Uh, it's a Hydro Max hydraulic braking system, fully commercial grade, 50,000 pound PSI frame rail, uh, low alloy steel. It's straight all across the top for easy mounting of equipment. In this case, we put a 16 foot box on it. This unit was also ordered with the optional 7.1 CFM air compressor. It's got the small air tank located behind the steps on the driver's side. On the passenger side of the vehicle, you've got your def fill, which is opposite of the fuel tank to minimize the chances of putting the wrong fluid in each tank. You've also got chrome mirrors on this unit with marker lights. And on the steps below, there are self-cleaning steps. So if you've got muddy boots, ice and snow, you're not tracking as much into the cab of the truck. We're on the driver's side of the vehicle. And I also want to note on the mirrors that they do have turn signal. They are manually folding, they manually extend. Uh, they are heated and power adjustable. We've got the hood up on this International CV. And as you can see, it is a tilt forward commercial style hood with easy access to all your components, service and general maintenance. Under the hood is the International 6.6 .6, 350 horsepower, 700 foot pounds of torque. cab of the International CV, you've got your gauge cluster, you've got steering wheel controls, cruise control, headlights, you've got the shifter for drive, park, neutral, reverse. The transmission on this particular unit is set up for performance shifting. The ALSA transmission is also equipped with a neutral at park or at stop so that when you're stopped at a red light, it'll shift into neutral and take some of the strain off of the engine that can serve some fuel. As soon as you let off the service brake, neutral kick back in the drive so you can go about your productive day. In the center you've got an 8 inch display for the radio which is AM, FM, USB, auxiliary input. You've also got uh, voice activated active controls and uh, navigation. You've got auxiliary switches down here which are on 30 amp fuses. You've got uh, turn off your trash control in case you're stuck in a sticky situation and you don't want trash control to take over and you want the wheels to spin more freely to get out. you got exhaust brake. And you can also dump the rear suspension because it is air. So you can dump that air if you need to to lower the rear end of the vehicle. Of course, your HVAC controls. You have airbags in the front and on the sides. This is a three passenger vehicle. The driver's seat is 10 way adjustable with a manual adjust lumbar. You also have the center console that can flip down when you just have two riders or just one. You got cup holders, you have storage. I think. Oh yeah, you even have the mirrors and make sure you're looking good during your day as well with some lights in the visor. I'd also like to point out that this is a tilting steering wheel. It's got a, a pretty good range as far as its adjustability. At the rear of this CV, which has got a 16 foot box on it, you've got your diesel fill, which is a 40 gallon tank. I should have mentioned earlier, the dev tank is 6.75 gallons. I'm standing here at the back of the International CV. The GVW on this unit is 19,500 pounds. It's got a 7,000 pound front axle and a 13,500 pound rear axle with an air ride suspension. So you can know that whatever cargo you're carrying is safely being handled. The transmission, like I've said before, is a 1700 highway series transmission that is set for perform performance programming for a productive day. We'll go more into talking about the box itself. It's got a step bumper, 
and a 12 foot walk ramp for access to the box. The floor in this unit is one inch and one eighth. It is a laminated wood with a undercoating to protect it from rot over the years. On the back of this box, we have a transglobal composite door. I've been in this business a long time and we all know that when you see a box that's been around for a while, I mean, they're splitting, paint's chipping, they, they look rough and you're lucky that when you don't grab the handle, it doesn't pull through the door. So this is a composite door that Hercules does for us. I'm in the back of this box. Down at the bottom, you have a 12 inch high scuff board that's three quarter inches thick and it's hardwood. You've got E-Track at 30 inches and at 60 inches. Your hat posts, which are galvanized, are on 24 inch centers. So a very sturdy, very reliable box. We, you know, we have a great partnership with Hercules and they've done us well for many years. The cross members in the floor are on 12 inch centers. Once again, extremely sturdy. Tons of places in this box to secure your load. The number one reason why you should choose an international CV for all your class four and five needs is it is the only chassis on the market today that is being designed, built, and supported by a manufacturer who specializes in commercial vehicles.